floor of Sodar Studio and Mormino Headquarters building. So we're outside the front door of the classroom and I'm gonna take you through. <clears throat> so feel free to comment if you have questions. After this, I'll probably show product that we have available. Um, talk about classes. I'm sorry, it's shaky. I really wanna buy one of those like gimbals. Um, I just haven't. <laughs> But we are in the classroom of So Whatever Studio. We have 16 industrial machines, 15 tickets within classes generally. And um, if you look straight ahead, you'll see the TV where we play music from. And then we also offer video for our teachers to be able to show what they're sewing if that lends itself to the class. Um, I'll try not to make this too long, just in case for people who will be re-watching. Um, you walk in, turn this way, you'll see our closet where we have orders available for pickup or people to put in their like big coats, big bags, things like that, um, that they don't necessarily need in the way. Hello everybody. Um, we have our heat press area here. So this is where people can fuse their interfacing or make their so whatever studio shirts or totes or whatever um, we have transfers that are included in the class we just ask that people don't take like more than one please <laughs> um, but then there's also these thread pieces you can cut to put all over the shirt or just put them on the sleeves super fun <clears throat> hi kathy um we have 10 rivet presses that we've custom painted and then we have all of the scrap items <clears throat> that are available for people to use within the class or to test machines or what have you. We have this amazing sign that my friend Josie um, bought and it's made from Jalili Creations. It just, it, it's perfect in this space, truly. <clears throat> we have cut tables for every student and Oh, hi. Um, this is our guest book wall. Um, this was a really fun idea. We needed something to kind of dampen the sound a little bit more. And so I bought these canvases and people can sign their name when they take a class. We also have um, these little things on the pole. My friend Kira designed those. They are for us to write your name on them so that even if you don't want to ask somebody um, their name, you can see it, you know, just kind of get to know everybody a little bit better. Oh, sorry. Um, we have thread and tools and rulers and rotary cutters and scissors and needles and, and just anything and everything you could possibly want. Um, and then we have interfacing within the classroom as well for everyone to use and a little cart where you can store your needs. These are little trash cans for you to put your scraps in. The floor is perfectly acceptable too. We will clean it up eventually. Yes, it is the best time ever. Every class we've had so far like has just been in, insane. I love it so much. But we have all kinds of interfacing. We have some games for the open sews when people don't wanna sew anymore but they still wanna hang out. All the thread. Um, and then we also have like a little bit of hardware and this has been kind of fun because if people forget something, we might have it here. So um, if you, I know Deborah, me too, I want to live in this room. That's why I built it. <laughs> um, if you have stuff you like never used, you're welcome to bring it and kind of donate, um, kind of like take a penny, leave a penny situation. Um, we also have clips available for you to use, which this is really fun. These are cereal containers, so you can just pour some out. We have different dyes for the presses, and we're always getting more. Um, Kathy recently sent over some goggles, so if anybody's worried about um, getting a needle in their eye and they don't want to put a ruler over their face, they can always just do that. Um, this is our bathroom, and we have everything in here you could possibly need. It's kind of fun to put together like hairspray, scrunchies, phone chargers, um, pads, things like that, feminine needs. Um, and then we do have a microphone system that my friend Kira helped set up. 
And so if you are <laughs> hard of hearing or anything, we can always set up the microphone. Can I come over and play? Yes, please. Yes, you'll have to contact her for the sign. I think her husband makes all those. I prefer the roller too. I'm just like, you know, then you don't get any dents in your hair. It's fine. <laughs> all kinds of thread. All kinds of double-sided tape. Everything you could possibly imagine. Really comfortable chairs for everybody too. Um, so yeah, somebody put a lot of money signs. Yes. Setting it all up was very expensive. <laughs> We have these made at So Whatever Studio labels from Heartwood and Hyde, all kinds of things here. And then a cylinder arm for people to try out. All of the machines are from Sunny Sewing in Texas. It is a little piece of heaven. It's the bag makers heaven. No, <laughs> we'll come travel anytime. <laughs> yeah, the chairs are so comfy. All right, so when you walk out, you're now in HQ, HQ proper. <laughs> this is all the new space that we built on, just super exciting. Um, this is where we pack orders um, and, you know, roll vinyl, all that stuff. This is our desk area. This is new product shelving or things that need to be done, more or less. Again, I'm so sorry for the shaky camera. I am doing my best. <laughs> um, little photography area and then a little bit of overstock. I'll show you a little bit of new product while we're here. We'll set this down. Um, we have some new binding colors. We have some new webbing coming. And then of course we've stocked some, but this is a new binding that we're trying out. It's 1.75 wide so that you can use um, that method that's definitely used by Not at Threads Co. and others, but you lay it down, stitch it on, and then kind of wrap it around. And instead of cutting it, you can actually just fold this under again so that there's no raw edge and definitely no fraying. I tried it out on the bag and I really liked it, um, but I sent it to a couple of people to try. Thought would be fun. And then we have some new webbing, which is exciting. This is all shale vinyl clay, or shale clay vinyl. <laughs> My bad. And then over here is my desk. This is the biggest mess in the world of squishmallows and samples if you look over there you'll see um future project box things and coffee in my purse that i finished this morning um this is tammy and alexis's station this is where they pull and pack your orders most of the time and then me and steve's desk is over here we'll cut webbing roll vinyl whatever this is our kitchen space. This seam here is where we've added on. So for our classes, we have a wonderful break room full of all kinds of things and a little coffee area and tons of snacks. You can see the old space through the door, but I'm gonna take you around this way in the warehouse. Yes, so pretty neat. I cannot have it any other way. I truly, truly can't. I hate the mess. <clears throat> So we've got previous releases in stock, all kinds of matches on the website as well. Um, some people have found it on the website, but we actually have a Sew Whatever Studio vinyl, clear confetti, it's so fun. Yes, give it a home. <laughs> I did not make this, but it's the most beautiful bag. The most beautiful bag. Okay. Translucent vinyls, jelly vinyls, all that fun stuff. Um, and if there's anything you guys really want to see, let me know. Clear vinyl. I can't believe people haven't found this one. Yes, all this from the gal who used to sit on the floor cutting with scissors. So proud of you, thank you. I wish I could go back to that some days, but this is pretty fun too. We've got our striped scissor holographic glitter. <clears throat> Kira, I'm not giving the bag up. 
she can't make me. Two of everything, please. Hi, Sandra, how are you? What is this one? Which one? Uh, the clear holographic TPU. Oh my gosh, you guys, I need to get something to get rid of the uh, shake. Yes, all of these are listed on the website. We have so much product in stock, it is unreal. <laughs> We've got double-sided tape, eighth inch, quarter, half, and three-quarter. All of that is from Weft & Warp Co., but it is some of the best double-sided tape that I've ever used. It's my favorite. Glitter clips, all kinds of pre-made straps, webbing, all kinds of webbing. Here is a sneak peek of what's releasing. We've got Lovers and then um, Black and White. Super fun. And then we've got some room to grow, which is fun. And then different printed vinyls over there. <clears throat> These are the mid-weight vinyls. These are very domestic friendly. So beautiful. We've got that ballet slipper. Yes, the organization is definitely a group effort as well. Everything being labeled is thanks to the warehouse manager, Tammy. Ballet slipper pink so good it's so hard not to like walk around and be like i want that i need that but it's all here because i said i want that and i need that lace vinyls we've got all kinds of colors super super gorgeous and then these are all our lux vinyls which are the microfiber backed oh my gosh watch the first video the other day my very first video um is actually it's been deleted it was in the swoon facebook group a million years ago. Um, our Ace Vinyls. We cannot keep these on the shelf, you guys. Have just been loving them. But we restocked the Punch Bowl glitter. Which is like the prettiest, like, pinky red sparkle. So good. Um, but we have that in pink, gold. We have a little bit of black. A little bit of silver, a little bit of blue, not a lot though. Punch bowl is the best. I know we can't, we can't keep it. Um, these are the ultra soft vinyls. We've got Persian pink. These are so soft, like satin vinyl, truly, and a nice thickness too. So we've got blue, orange, pink, and then a couple of our older um, printed, oh, dropped my pop socket. <laughs> Older printed vinyls, and then these are the colors of bag binding that we offer currently. And I, I don't know if you've ever seen it, but we have a little bit of pre-made piping that matches the royal violet. <clears throat> that was my foot if you thought I farted. <laughs> Um, all kinds of vinyls. If there's one you're like, <clears throat> let me see that or find something that matches it, let me know because I think that'd be so fun. Um, this is our Twilight range, which are ultra glossy vinyls. Very soft as well. And then um, <laughs> we have our glazed clay vinyls. These have less of a sheen, but are still just as soft and delicious. And then our fan favorites is definitely the clay vinyl. These are matte. We have tons of shale that just came back in stock. And shale is like a black color, but it's not like a true, true black. It's more of like a gray black. Terra Rosa, very pretty. We've got concrete which again is kind of, it's not really a glossy surface. That one's fun. And then we also have some accessory weight. I've gotten a lot of people say like, I don't know what accessory weight means. And basically, um, it's more domestic friendly of a, of a thickness. 
So we have accessory weight and mid weight and mid, mid weight honestly feels like a structured cork. It's kind of fun, but they, the Lux vinyls all have this like soft fuzzy backing. Bought a new car. <laughs> it goes with that super soft pink. Yeah. Oh yeah. I can match. Ballet pink all day. Pretty much the watercolor rose vinyls and prints go with it as well. <clears throat> a little ghost would go with it. Um, or black and white flowers would go with it. The Eras Tour fabric definitely goes with it. not to make the camera shake <laughs> okay i pulled the ballet slipper um to go over to our other prints <laughs> yeah that's true three to four layers of accessory weight on my domestic easy peasy yes for sure so we've got all kinds of luxe colors i pulled that ballet pink over near our prints um, this is one that's coming soon. We had a little sneaky release of it, but it's back in full force. Um, we don't actually, Cindy, have a true red vinyl that isn't shiny, um, but we are working to expand our range. So send me an email and I'll look into it. We have like a glossy luxe vinyl. Our gloss lux it is shinier though but it's so pretty just one of those sitting there hanging out um we have tons of zipper tape and then these are all the mystery woven labels so if you order and you need a certain one you can always let us know tons of zipper tape and I think we still have a sneaky zipper tape sale. Just saying. If if I put a product on sale, I don't like to advertise it because I'm like, well, people will find out if they wanted it. I'm terrible, I know. Um, but this is the Airs Tour print. We have a ton of that. And matching webbing, the woven, or the um, piano webbing, and matching zipper pulls and woven labels. Can I see the black vinyl that is smooth? We do have um, accessory weight and regular. Ballet pink should be available. If not, I can stock it. It should be available though. Um, so this is our black Lux vinyl. It really is just like a satin sheen, no texture, nice and smooth. Well, if there is texture, it is very, very minimal. So we have that. Um, and then we have the black Lux, which is, or accessory weight, which is the same, but thinner, like half thick. Oh, thank you, Kira. And then this is our water resistant canvas wall. So water resistant canvas, if you've not used it, is like a thinner structured waterproof canvas. I really enjoy it. Um, do you have a black shiny, but not glittery? So we did have a gloss black, it was called Black Rubber Boot. It will come back. Um, otherwise, we have the Shale. Oh, no. Shale is not. Or we have Jacob Black, actually. Yes, Jacob Black is a shiny but not glittery vinyl. Um, otherwise... Where is that one? Um, this is black rubber boot. This is also a good one. Um, and you can always email us to see if we have something in back stock, but because USPS has been prone to losing orders, we always keep one or two in back stock and then stock it later when we realize this isn't on the website. Um, we have a ton of hardware in stock right now. So, and kits on the website, if you guys didn't know, if you're looking for a particular bag 
we have kits that you can just select the color you need and add it to your cart. Very helpful. I have used it. <laughs> when I place an order on the website, I'm like, mm, uh, just going to get that. Um, this is cotton woven coming soon. These are all in stock. We have bamboo French terry in stock as well. So if you're making um, some like comfy pants or a cardigan, that is really nice. I don't know if you guys knew this, but we have Sofu's bundles as well. A little trial bundle, one yard cuts. These are dust bags that we have in stock. So if you want to cover your bag. I hear a car. Oh, it's Steve. He actually came in. Sweet. I thought I was alone today. Um, <laughs> tons of notions and fun things. I don't know if anybody knew. I have a paper pattern. Hi, how's it going? It's Steve. Hi. <laughs> I'm live on YouTube. <clears throat> Stickers, magnets, pop sockets, washi tape. Um, we still have a couple of these tumblers in stock and they are full of product. Hi. You want to be on YouTube or no? No? I'm so sorry, what? Do you want to be on YouTube? Um, oh, no. Okay, I'm live. Okay. Just give them a tour. Cool. Where yeah. are you at? Like, where are you shooting? Right here. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? What, do you, what are you doing live? Oh, I'm showing them all the things we have here. A little tour. Gotcha. Yeah. Cool. Right. A little tour. Have fun. Continue. Yeah. I'm going to just go for roll stuff. Okay, sounds good. <laughs> um, and this is where I've got the C2E2 set up currently. So I can show you some of the bags, but I'll go over matches really quick for the ballet slipper. <clears throat> Um, so I think our itty bitty floral range would match it really pretty, but we also have the blue classic teacup, which would be fun. Or yeah, the black and white teacup would be really pretty with it as well. That one doesn't match as perfectly, but the vinyl we had in stock definitely did. Mm. The teacup um, flowers is one of my favorite prints for sure. We have so many different colorways of it. And this one matches very good for fall. Very, very good. I don't know. Um, and we do have matching webbing for this one, but not the others. But then we have a ton of cotton prints and a ton of merch. A ton of different shirts. We've got sweatshirts. A lot of small and medium. Um in case you needed that. <laughs> Squeezing through. Look at that rosy. Um, this is the old existing HQ space. We still have a ton of these waterproof canvases in stock as well. The rainbow teacup, I can turn a light on. Um, and then we, we have the lovers waterproof cotton in stock this one sold out so fast so many people were like oh my god please bring it back and we did indeed bring it back <clears throat> okay now the lights are on over here this is our back room where we cut fabrics and store upcoming releases etc so we've got some more waterproof cotton that just hasn't been cut. Some TARDIS pink. Um, this is our scrap box. So when Lexi makes scrap boxes, uh, this is all the product she throws in there. It's just like slightly damaged, slightly defective, just things that aren't perfect that we don't want to send out. So that's always fun. Let's see. 
This one's coming up to that's nice. The cotton woven. Different waterproof or um, water resistant canvas to cut. And that's pretty much it. Um, this is where we've been storing display things and it's just kind of a mess. Eventually I want to make it like a cute checkout area. Um, but this is our current C2E2 setup, which is um, our last Comic-Con in Chicago that we're doing and everything that's been made for it so far. So yeah, if there's anything else anybody wants to see, let me know. I'd love to show you or if you have any questions. Um, but overall, I just wanted it to be a quick walkthrough with minimal busyness, hopefully. Um, but I do hope to take an industrial sewing machine to C2E2 and work on some more bags while I'm there. If I get them done, cool. If I don't. Um, the ultra soft vinyls are the ones that are are really soft <clears throat> it's like ultra soft <laughs> I'm a loser right now um, I did not count how many bags that I have prepped but I do need to go through and um, price them but I made a bunch of Louis waste bags here I have some one with more me nose that are super simplified. Um, the cocoa bean glazed clay vinyl will restock. Yes, absolutely. Um, we might have a few on the shelf, so feel free to email us and we can um, get you an invoice. Because sometimes if we stock it and a bunch of people are signed up for restock alerts, then they get mad because they're like, where is it? So we don't want to restock it unless we have a bunch. But I've got all kinds of guardians, rosies. I got one little map pack there. <clears throat> oh my gosh, Tiff, I know all the dusts are on the new side. You need to come back. Hello, would you explain the difference between the waterproof canvas and the waterproof cotton? The waterproof canvas has a PVC backing. So if you're allergic to that kind of material, um, the waterproof cotton is going to be good. It has a waterproof surface, but it doesn't have that like PVC backing basically. So it's a really soft fabric, but still structured. We got lots of Catalinas and um, some hinterlands. So much stuff. The moon dances as well, those were super fun to make. And this is double sided, so it's three Kallax units kind of set up on wheels. <laughs> some Mr. Heckles bags and all that. So I'm really excited. We're also going to be selling. Um, some supplies and things. So we've got a table here and then this little L-shaped piece there. And then we've got all the dresses and some neckties and things like that. Um, so yeah. And then I'll... I want that Star Wars. Oh yeah. It is a really cute one with the pink. So good. Um, and then we have a bunch of bathrooms here actually. Oh, the purse piles I made too. These are so cute. I think one of these takes me like 25 minutes to make. So I've been cranking those out. Walk back through the kitchen. There's Steve's apple. Eight hour drive's not bad. And then we're back. So thanks for hanging out with me for a little bit. Um, let us know if you guys have any questions. And I'll see you later. Bye.